Welcome to the season review for Nagaland, where it was a bit of an interesting season, a bit of a roller coaster, you'd say. The one day competition was our best competition, making the semi finals a very unlikely run. T20s were incredibly bad. <laughs> And the first class competition is just recently um, completed and we finished in ninth place. It was an alright effort considering we're um, sort of rebuilding at the moment, just getting our team set up for the seasons to come. We've got um, some players getting more experience as we go along. Tried out a lot of players this season. Uh, we'll quickly go over the other tables as well. Obviously we got knocked out in there, but we had a very good campaign where we finished in the second position with six wins, two losses and one tie. 20 over trophy. We were embarrassed completely. Uh, we did win a game somehow. We didn't finish last. But yeah, let's look at the player records and that for the season, guys. And um, just see how we um, did. The first class year, yeah, it was a bit of a tough one. Joel, uh, 639 runs at 37.59. That's a good year for him. Like, I'm very impressed how he's going about his work. Judge Hunter, uh, pretty disappointing year for him. 595 runs at 37.19. Asim Panda was okay at uh, 479 runs at 43.55. Vaida, not 470 runs at 27.65. Sine, 402 runs at 36.55. The averages are just a bit down. That's why we finished a bit lower down the table. Um, Harsh Tayagi was okay. Gil was disappointing. Manu Gol was improved a little bit um, with the bat, which is good. I'm really working hard on his batting. Morris was very handy with the bat as well. He's becoming a very useful lower order um, batsman. Kumar had a few opportunities. Das had a few opportunities. So to waste. They didn't really take their chances. To the wicket takers. Uh, Morris was the leading wicket taker for us this season. 27 wickets at 37, uh, 31.30. This young talent. 17 years of age. Got given a fair go. And he's taken his opportunity to be honest. He's one for the future that we're going to continue to develop. Sam Path Khan played 8 first class matches. He was really good again. 25 wickets at 31.32. Tyagi took most of those wickets for India. He was um, very bad for us. There, there's his true average. 13 wickets at 47.23. He'd he done a tidy job, you know. It was economical. Done a handy few things with the bat as well. Like That's what Harsh Tyagi does. Manu Gol. Good season. Very good season. 21 wickets at 27.24. The pick of the bowl is, I reckon. Pratap, uh, disappointing. 19 wickets at 41.79. He's better cracker than that. Sodi, slid us down a wee bit again. Um, Shahan got a few opportunities. 8 wickets at 20.37. Shankar got a game. 1 wicket at 93. And Panda didn't do too much. Overall, the first class year, we did enough to survive in effectively the third division of first class cricket, but we want to start moving up that table to start eventually challenging to get into that second um, group. So the one day current year, our best year to date. The runs, Judge Hunter was brilliant, 492 runs at 61.5. Kumar was really good, 472 runs at 42.91. Panda. 386 runs at 42.89. You can see a difference already. Like the guys were averaging a bit better. Shrub and Gill's numbers are a wee bit down. I'm really tempted to move Shrub and Gill on, actually. Uh, just to maybe get another couple of young openers in. Vaida was really good. Sione offered a wee bit of handiness down the order. Das had six opportunities, didn't really take anything. Tayagi was okay. Goal. Joel got a game. The wicket takers, Khan, exceptional. He's a very good limited overs bowler. You'd think he's going to be a regular fixture at age 25 for the next seven or eight seasons at least. 22 wickets at 16.91, outstanding. Goal was the next best wicket taker, 16 wickets at 29. The all-rounder continues to do a really handy job there. Uh, 15 wickets for Chauhan, 12 for Pratap. Sorry, he was okay when he was there, 11 wickets at 17.09. He was... Tony Morris, um, as mentioned, the young 17-year-old, got a fair bit of opportunities. 11 wickets at 33.55. It's just a good positive start to his career. Tyagi uh, and Panda, 8 wickets and 5 wickets respectfully for the 20 over comp. Where are the runs? These are pretty inflated averages, but JH Hunter, that's disappointing for him. 19.67 average at 354. There wasn't too many runs, um, to say the least, um, from our batsmen. There's not really too much to talk about there. The wicket takers, he's played a little bit for his IPL club. Morris, 9 wickets at 14.33. Sodi, 5 wickets at 10. Tenth Path Khan, a wee bit um, down on his number. So was Patap, actually. That's why we were so bad. Shankar got a few goes. 
so did Chaham. But that's yeah, that's why we're second last in that group. I was incredibly disappointed how we played in that competition. Yeah, tough, tough season, guys. It's sort of we we sort of have to um, just develop the team over the next few seasons again. Well, this is going to be a very long um, save anyway. I'm really enjoying the Nagaland career mode. Like I've really invested a lot of time into the series. Continue to support the um, series, guys, by liking and sharing with a friend. Keep growing that community, eh? Like keep putting comments in the sections and that. I, I quite enjoy reading those. I always try to reply back to everyone. But yeah, we've got to do a bit of rebuilding still. I reckon we need another quality spinner. And we just need to keep um, developing and getting some new batsmen in to really um, bring the best out of everyone. So the next episode, guys, will obviously be the recruitment special. We will see you guys then for that episode.